Hello, I'm Loredana and today I'll show you how you can create and understand D-type types visually. D-type is a decentralized type system where people can reuse types created by others, increasing interoperability between projects. Here on the right we have all the types defined in Solidity. Let's remove this existing type by dragging it and dropping it into this area and create some new types. Distance and Volume. Distance will contain a uint describing the distance in millimeters. Volume will contain a uint describing the volume in cubic millimeters. Now we can add these types to the list of existing types so we can use them further to compose other more complex types. Here they are. So now we can define a spatial dimensions type that will contain a volume and a length, width and depth dimensions. For this we will use a tuple with the product operator. So let's add volume and we see that we cannot use types that haven't been already defined. Now we need three distance subtypes and we will use the same tuple block to add them. This will be the length width and depth. Looking at the JSON description, we see that our type is composed from four subtypes, volume, length, width, and depth. The solidity representation is this. Now we can define spatial dimensions in another way with arrays. We will again use the tuple and add a volume subtype. But now we will use a distance array to encompass all the dimensions and this will have a length of 3. So now looking at our JSON description we see that our second type contains only two subtypes. And the dimensions subtype is an array with a length of three. The solidity representation of this is this, where the first item of the array is the length, the second is the width, and the third is the depth. This is how you can construct types visually without writing a line of code. D-Type aims to increase interoperability inside your project's components and between your project and everybody else's. Thank you for watching and make sure you see our other demos.